In last lecture, we discuss about a simple definition of sensitivity and also we derive a general formula for sensitivity. In this lecture, we will find sensitivity of a closed loop system. Now consider a closed loop system. To be specific, we have considered a negative feedback closed loop system whose transfer function Ps is nothing but Gs upon 1 plus Gs into H of S. Now many a times the transfer function T can be simply written as G upon 1 plus G into H. So there is no need to write G of S and H of S all the time. So both the formulas are totally correct. So from the transfer function of a closed loop system, we can say the transfer function T of S is a function of the forward gain block G and the feedback element H. So we can define the sensitivity of transfer function with respect to the forward gain G and is given by dou T by T upon dou G by G. This dou T by T is nothing but change in transfer function with respect to the change in forward gain element which is G. Also, we can define sensitivity of a transfer function with respect to the feedback element H and is given by dou T by T which is nothing but the change in transfer function with respect to dou H by H this is the change in feedback element which is H. Now let us first discuss the sensitivity of the transfer function with respect to the forward gain element G in detail. This is the sensitivity of a transfer function T with respect to the forward gain element G and as we know it is given by dou T by T with respect to dou G by G. Now I can simply write this equation as G upon T into dou T by dou G. Let us mark this as equation number 1. Now in order to get the formula of sensitivity of a transfer function with respect to the forward gain G, I need to find the value of dou T upon dou G. So let us find dou T by dou G. This is nothing but we have to differentiate the transfer function T with respect to the forward gain G. We know the transfer function T value is G upon 1 plus G H. Now we have to differentiate this with respect to the forward gain block G. The transfer function T is a polynomial so we have to use the quotient rule of differentiation which is also called u by v rule. So you can see the formula of u by v and it is nothing but v into differentiation of u with respect to g minus u differentiation of v with respect to g upon v squared. So this g is nothing but our u function and 1 plus gh is nothing but our v function. So as per the formula, it is V. So I have V is nothing but 1 plus GH. Then it is differentiation of U with respect to G. I will get here 1 minus U. U is nothing but G into differentiation of V. So differentiation of 1 is 0 plus differentiation of GH with respect to G is h upon v square v is 1 plus g h square. So I can simply open the brackets I will get 1 plus g h minus g h upon 1 plus g h square. So can cancel this plus gh and minus gh. So the value of dou t 
upon rho g will be 1 upon 1 plus g h square. So you can substitute the value of rho t by rho g in equation number 1. Then we can get the value of sensitivity of a transfer function t with respect to the forward gain g that is nothing but g upon t the value of the transfer function t is g upon 1 plus g h into the value of dou t by dou g which is 1 upon 1 plus g h square so you can cancel this g this g this square and this term 1 plus g h is cancelled so finally, I have the final formula of sensitivity of a transfer function T with respect to the forward gain G as 1 upon 1 plus G H. So this is an important formula of sensitivity of a transfer function with respect to G. Now using this formula, let us see some numericals so that our concepts are more clear. So here we have a simple example on sensitivity of a negative feedback closed loop system. We are given with a negative feedback closed loop system with the value of forward gain element G as 100 and the value of feedback element H as 10. They have given the transfer function which is nothing but G upon 1 plus G H. So the question says in the negative feedback closed loop system the transfer function is as shown with the values of G and H respectively. First is to find the sensitivity of the closed loop transfer function. So the solution of first is very simple. We know the formula of sensitivity of a transfer function with respect to the forward gain element G is given by rho T by T upon rho G by t and it is nothing but we have already found the formula as 1 upon 1 plus g h. Now we have all the values of g and h so we can simply substitute it will be 1 upon 1 plus g is 100 h is 10. So the sensitivity is nothing but 1 upon and one. So we have found out the sensitivity of this closed loop transfer function. Next is asking if the forward gain element G changes by 10% due to temperature effect, then find the change in transfer function. So I can write the solution to here he is asking to find the change in transfer function. And we know the change in transfer function is nothing but rho t by t. This is change in transfer function. Now we have to find this change in transfer function when the forward gain element g changes by 10%. Means this value is changed by 10%. So the change in forward gain element is nothing but rho g by g. This is the change in forward gain element, change in g. That is nothing but 10%. So we have the formula of sensitivity as sensitivity of a transfer function with respect to the forward gain element g that is given by rho t by t upon rho g by t. Now we have already found the sensitivity and is nothing but 1 upon 1000, 1001 equals to change in transfer function rho t by t which is to be found upon change in the forward gain element at this 10%. So I'll write here 10%. So the Change in transfer function rho t by t 
is nothing but 10 percent upon 1000 and 1 so it is 0.01 percent now this is a very good conclusion from this example from this example we can see even if the forward gain element is changing by 10 percent our overall transfer function is changing only by 0.01% and this is an advantage when you use a closed loop system.